Hi gardeners, here are four herbs I recommend that you should always have in your garden and also uh, include in your diet. We're going to start with this one. This is the sweet basil, circulation problems. All these plants, circulation, varicose veins. Uh, heart problems basil I think this is the Tulsi some people call it the Tulsi poor circulation cold hands and my favorite has got to be this one go to collar this one uh, grows wild so when I weed the garden I just keep a uh, a clump of it it grows like strawberries this you can have in a tea you can wash your face you can uh, have it in a salad just like how you would with nasturtiums go to color and then we have my favorite parsley jam-packed with iron folic acid vitamin C last but not least these are not the only ones that help with uh, circulatory uh, system problems. We have the rosemary. Wash, eat, drink. Uh, if you have the means, you can get ready-made um, supplements, but I prefer the raw herbs. For circulation, varicose veins, Poor circulation, varicose veins, cold hands, um, heart problems, and all that, and clotting, uh, clotting of blood, and uh, heavy periods. So we said sweet basil, go to cola, the tulsi, rosemary, and good old parsley. Cause uh, after that incident of the, you know what, the C19 and also uh, where we were mandated to take the and uh, we had to be indoors our lack of knowledge led us into a panic so do yourself a favor if you're a gardener make sure that you have these herbs you won't regret and uh, in this day and age we are having problems with having so-called problems with food so growing a garden is the best what is that I thought it was a snake the best thing you can do for yourself you and your family friends and loved ones special herbs you pass me I love it now and then I'll just take and chomp 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 please do yourself a favor Clotting of blood, cold hands, varicose veins, numbness in the feet. Uh, what else? You work long hours, you're always on your feet. Incorporate these herbs into your diet or make a tea. You can just combine all of them and make a nice tea for yourself. Have it cold, have it hot. Uh, the, the, the functions, the benefits and the functions of the, what the, the, the herbs do to your body are countless. So go ahead. Here is a nice combo for your health. Thank you.